Welcome to Road Gear Reviews. I'm Mark from RV Love and today we're talking about the NOCO Genius Boost Pro GB150 Jump Starter. Stay tuned. Welcome back to Road Gear Reviews. Today we're talking about the NOCO GB150 Genius Boost Pro Jump Starter. Basically it's a portable battery that's meant to jump start any of your vehicles. It's going to be jump starting a car all the way up to a motorhome, up to a 10 liter diesel or gas engine. They have smaller versions of this product, but this is the Mac Daddy, the GB150. There's a serious amount of power in this little package. It's 4,000 amps, 22,000 joules. And to compare that with a lead acid version of a jump starter, which is normally about 3,000 amps compared to this 4,000 amps, this has three times the power because the joules are what's really jump starting the engine. This is a lithium battery and it comes in a pretty compact space really. It's seven and a half pounds, it's three inches by seven inches by 12 inches in size, comes in its, with a carry bag, it comes with some additional accessories we'll talk about in just a minute. It has a 500 lumen light which is super bright that has seven different modes of flashing so you can use these as a nice warning and alert to other drivers that might be coming up to your area. But if you leave it in the steady on, it would be a really powerful light if you need to change a tire or something like that. This box contains the additional accessories. This is a bag to be able to carry it so you don't have to be carrying around the big box anymore. It has the instruction manuals, and it has the USB charger, and it has the extension cord for the 12 volt charger, it's the male and the female versions. I really like the quality of this product. It seems like it's so well thought out. It's very durable construction. All the buttons are nice quality. The digital readout is very easy to read. I really like these accessories because this I thought was really well thought out. The male and the female connect together to store in small. The cable is a universal so that it plugs in either way. So that instead of having a, each with their own cable, the same cable can be used for charging or from using this to charge something else. It's very good design. Inside here you have the input and the output. So on the inside this is a micro USB that charged with the USB cord that I'll show you in just a second and this is the 12 volt input that uses the cord that's provided. On the output there's a USB out to charge your devices and this is the 12 volt out and it uses the cord. Let's do the USB first. So you can see it's a normal USB on this side. This would plug into your USB charger and the micro USB comes here, plugs into here. It'll take about 11 hours to charge this fully using USB. If you want to charge that much quicker, use the 12 volt. And again, I love this, how this, this female and the male attach together, take them apart use the cord, plug the cord into the male part, plug Charge. this into your 12 volt charger, and then plug this end in here, and now it'll charge in three hours instead of 11 hours. As far as getting power out of this, use the same cord, but instead of the male part of the 12 volt, use the female part. Now you plug this into the output, and plug your 12 volt item into here. It's really efficient design. As far as the USB out, again just plug the USB in there and you can plug the micro USB into your micro USB device. But you can also charge other things with it. In fact you can charge a cell phone up to 10 times, an iPhone. You can charge little headsets up to 30 times. You can charge a lot of small devices with the USB charger but it's really not what this is meant for. It's great to have that extra battery power, but it's really meant to jumpstart your cars, and that's where it really excels. 80 times it can jumpstart a vehicle, and it can jumpstart a vehicle as big as our RV because it can go up to a 10 liter engine, and that's gas or diesel. In fact, we actually know someone who jumpstarted their 7.3 liter diesel engine totally cold. They had let it sit overnight, the glow plugs were cold, they actually removed the battery from the truck and used only this NOCO to start their vehicle. So it's definitely got some juice behind it. 
So today we're just going to be using it on our little Mini Cooper, which is only a 1.6 liter engine, so it should have no trouble with that. And we intentionally killed the battery on our car so we can show you how this works. So let's go give it some juice. All right, so I'm in the car. I'm going to try and give it a start. You see, it won't even click. It's so dead. It's dead. It's a good opportunity to put the NOCO to work. All right, so this is super simple to use. You just turn on the power button and you'll see the LED lights come up to show that we're fully charged. And again, when this is fully charged, this can do up to 80 jump starts. And this is the button for the lights, which you can see a little better now that we're in a shadow. And then all you need to do is remove these alligator clips from the actual booster and hook it up to your battery. Something important I'd want to call out is that there's a built-in volt diagnostic tool here. Right now it's blacked out, but as soon as I plug it to a battery, it's going to show how many volts are on the battery. And if this is a great diagnostic tool because if your batteries showed over 12 volts when you first connect it, then your problem might not be the battery itself. So let's let's hook it up and see if we can get this thing started. One of the other important features of this that I'm really excited about is that it's very safe. If any of you have ever used jumper cables, you'll know that you have to be super careful with the alligator clips after you hook it to the jump starting car because if you touch them, there's huge sparks that go everywhere. But with this, not at all. You can totally touch them together, no sparks. I love how safe that is. So I really like that safety feature because I've had enough times when I'm working with someone that's not familiar with them and they spark and arc, and this is a much safer way to do this. So you click the black one on your negative terminal for your battery, and on our car, the positive terminal is over here. So be sure to watch that gauge when I plug this on. 7.7. .7. Okay, so now it's getting up to 12. Let's go ahead and give it a try. I'll give it a try and start it. <laughs> that was super easy. First turnover, super fast. It's a great product. Again, this is a really small engine. It's under two liters, but this jump starter is the big one. And it's meant to be able to jump start vehicles as big as 10 liter gas or diesel. Now we're up and running. We'll just take these back off. Again, not having to worry about putting them both in one hand because they won't spark. And of course, Anytime you jump start a car with a dead battery, you're going to want to let it run for a while to let it charge itself up. So we'll let that charge while we talk about some of the other features of this. All the products that Julie and I have reviewed here on Road Gear Reviews have been purchased ourselves with products that we've enjoyed and really feel important for the lifestyle. Julie and I had had flat batteries on our RV and our car recently, so we were actively shopping for a jump starter. The GB150 was on our short list in our shopping, so it was great when NOCO reached out to us and asked if we'd review it for them and share our thoughts on the product. So let me tell you what I think about it. I'm actually super impressed with this. The more I've researched it, the more impressed I get. The amount of power in this small package is amazing. To be able to jumpstart a 10 liter engine, a gas or diesel, is very impressive. Now, NOCO does make smaller jump starters. I think the GB40 is only about $100 compared to the $300 for this unit. So it's a lot less expensive. It'd be a lot lighter as well. This weighs seven and a half pounds. Those smaller ones might be great and it might be all you need for your car. But we liked having the big one because this can jumpstart the car or the motorhome and we're able to help out any of our friends that have larger vehicles as well. Really great design. It's a high quality product. I have a lot of trust that this is going to last a long time. In fact, the battery alone lasts a long time. I charged this thing up over a month ago and I thought this is great that it lasts a month, but then I did some research and realized it'll keep its charge for a full year. This is a very impressive product because you can just throw it in the trunk of your car and carry it around and that way you have it anytime the battery dies on your own car, but also have it available to help jump start somebody else. And with the ultra safe feature on that, it's not like juggling around with the jumper cables. It's very compact. Just set it on the vehicle you need to jump start, put it on there and start it. I think this is a fantastic product, especially for people who like to go boondocking. If you're in a big city, you can call roadside assistance and there might be other cars around that can jump start you. But if you're out in the boondocks, 
it's fantastic to have something small and portable that you can just be carrying around in the trunk of your car or in the back of your truck to be able to jump start it whenever your battery dies so you don't end up stranded. I love how compact it is and powerful it is. Seven and a half pounds feel, sounds like a lot of weight when you're an RVer, but there's so much power in that little thing that I feel it's definitely worth that weight and certainly worth that size. It's not an inexpensive product. It's about $300 for one of these. If that seems really expensive to you, you could probably look at one of the less expensive NOCO products. They do have them for around $100, I believe, for the 40 GB, which would be able to jumpstart most regular passenger cars, but maybe not these larger engines that the GB150 is capable of. So you can pick whatever size is appropriate for you and what vehicles you drive. But personally, I really like having the large one, the GB150, because I like knowing that when I'm down the road and if I see somebody stranded that needs a jump start, I have a jump starter that's going to be able to start pretty much any vehicle out there, even if they have a big diesel truck. So this 12 volt power port that goes outbound power, you can charge tire pumps and inverters and lights, anything that you can charge with your 12 volt power from the regular dash of your car. This particular unit is for high displacement gas and diesel engines. So you can jumpstart your cars, trucks, boats, RVs, commercial vehicles and equipment. It's safe to use on any engine of any size. Just because this is capable of jumpstarting a big engine doesn't mean you can't use it on a small engine. So this has been a review of the NOCO GB150 Genius Boost Pro Jump Starter. Definitely a very big fan of this product. I think it's awesome. If you have any questions or comments or any other products you'd like to see us review here on Rogue Gear Reviews, please put them in the comments below. We'll of course put links to the product in the description below. Be sure to click subscribe and check back every week for new videos from Rogue Gear Reviews. And until then, we'll see you on the road. I suppose I should probably go turn off the car now.